Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. This is JP Gaming UK. Uh, today we're here back on Train Sim Mode 3 because we're going to be doing one of the um, Birmingham Frost City scenarios. Um, I did try one earlier. If we go to Birmingham Frost City, I did try um, Snow Problem earlier today, but um, almost at the end of the video, I hit a red light, I went straight through it. So I didn't want to really do it again. So we're going to be doing another one today. We're going to be doing red, red wine um, because someone in my comment section on my last video mentioned this scenario. So I thought, shall we give it a try? Um, I ha have been tweaking around with my audio settings because uh, if you watch my last video, you should, you'd you know that um, it took me three attempts to record that video because the first two attempts had no audio whatsoever except my mic. That's the only thing that was being picked up. And that's because I didn't find out until afterwards that Apple had updated the iMac so that you can no longer record your screen audio. Um, and I had no idea. So I had to download all new software called Soundflower, I think it's called. Um, and I've never used it before, so um, this is all new to me, so I'm still getting used to it. I've been tweaking around with the audio, audio settings today, because I know in my last video, the game audio was very quiet, and obviously you could hear me, but the game audio is very quiet. Um, the only issue with um, Soundflower and doing it this way is I can't hear my game audio. You can, I can't. So I don't know how the levels are, so I'm hoping this is okay. Um, obviously I'll watch this video back after I've recorded it to see what it's like and try and improve for the next one. Um, but it's just a matter of tweaking at the moment. So I hope you can all bear with me while I sort all that out. But anyway, let's do this scenario. Um, I hope you're all well. Um, before we start, um, if you're new to my channel, I do train sim world videos, sims videos, planet coaster videos, um, mostly simulation game videos. So if you like that sort of content, please drop me a like and subscribe. It does help my channel to grow and get me seen on the algorithm. If you're not new to my channel, welcome back. You know your support is always greatly appreciated. And um, I hit 515 subscribers over the weekend, over this weekend. So I'm really happy with that. I'm trying to get to 1,000 by Christmas. If I don't, I don't. It's no hardship. Um, but for all your continu continued support and all my new supporters, thank you so much. But anyway, let's get on with this first scenario we're going to do today. It's called Red Red Wine. I think this is named after the UB40 song, which used to be my stepdad's favourite song. It's all we ever listened to in the car. And it's now stuck in my head. Scarred, burned for life. Right, so let's do this. Red Red Wine. As I said, I can't hear my game audio. Um, I can... Um, what, obviously, I have to wait till the video's ended so I can listen to what this sounds like. So like I said, I hope my levels are okay. I hope my microphone's not. But um, I've been tweaking around with the game settings to see if I can get it to work. But anyway, welcome to Redditch. The snow has caused major delays on the network at, with some services running. Oh, rude. I wasn't finished. Rude. Right, let's put it into neutral. Uh, let's reset the DRA. Looks like the Walking Dead down there. Oh, I don't like that. It's like a load of zombies. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so I hope you guys are okay and having a good weekend. I hope you've been enjoying Train Sim World this weekend. Um, to, start, to start with, I didn't like the Class 323. Just seemed like all the other trains we have in the game already. It just looks like a block upgraded uh, 465, but it's growing on me now, quite enjoying it. I'm going to do some liveries uh, this evening. I'm going to try and do a couple of liveries. Um, I might do one that's used to be on the line and then just create a few that I like, like regional railways, short railways, stuff like that. And I will be getting them up on the Creative Club. I've got a few on the Creative Club that I did, over, that did this weekend as well. I, I've done one for the 495, uh, 395 and I've done one for the 313. Or 314 um you can go and have a look at those on the creative club uh my creative club is the same as my channel name jb gaming uk one feel free to go and have a bruise and have a look at some of my creations i've got loads on there because in my spare time i just chill out with some music on and just make some liveries just zone out for a little bit right, okay, let's 
find some power. And let's do a little bit of um, horn porn, shall we? There you go, a bit of horn porn for you horn lovers out there. Yeah, like I said, the train's growing. Not a fan of the livery, but the train's growing. Not a fan of baby poo orange. But hey ho. <laughs> so now we're just gonna do a speed in. It's very wintry. speed a little bit, slow down. Right, our first stop is going to be Alf Church Platform 1 at 907. Hopefully we'll get there in time. In this weather, and with it being British Railways, I highly doubt that. As I was saying in my video that you're not going to get to see because it failed, um, I don't think I've ever been on a British train that's been on time, that hasn't been delayed, or hasn't been cancelled. Ever. I've never been on an on-time train. <laughs> I used to um, live in Watford and commute into London every day on the uh, Watford to London Euston Express service. And I was always late for work, to the point I ended up having to start leaving for work two hours earlier than I used to. And I'd still get to work 20 minutes before, before my shift would start. It was absolutely awful. And the, I, 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 obviously I live down south, on the south coast now. Um, and the trains down here, 10 times worse. Southwestern Railway is the worst company I have ever, oh, their, oh, their, trains, are, oh, their trains are constantly canceled, delayed, they just don't want to turn it up. To the point now, I barely catch trains. Barely catch them. That and they're too expensive. One of my friends still catches a train quite regularly for work. And the money he pays for a year's ticket is just astronomically obscene. For a season ticket, it's just outrageous. I mean, you could travel from where I am now to Newcastle, and it'll cost you about between, anywhere. Well, if you get a, a bargain ticket, about 90 quid. If you don't get a bargain ticket, you're about 400. You can go on holiday abroad for a week, though. Just the ticket <laughs> on a train in this country. Ridiculous. And they wonder why the trains are failing. Hey, hey. Let's stop winking. Leave your feet alone. Leave your feet alone. Sorry, my dog's chewing his feet. Do you know one thing, Dave? Put your window wipers on. There you go. I can see now. <laughs> I completely didn't realise I didn't have the window wipers on. For God's sake. God, I can tell I'm not moving today. <laughs> Go coming into our first station, and guess what? We're on time, people.
Don't know if we're gonna stop though. No. Stop, 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 stop. Well, we've overshot it a little bit. Not not as bad as it, it could be, trust me. Just don't get out of these doors, anyone. You might have a bit of a fall. Apparently this one's only a 45 minute uh, scenario, so hopefully it'll be a good one. There's a door. Next stop is Bark Green Platform. What are those spikes for at the end of the platform? I've never. Obviously, that like, it it obviously got to be to stop people like going to the end of the platform. That's not really going to stop anybody, is it? I don't think. Saying that, I don't even think. Oh, aren't they made of wood in real life? I don't. I don't even know if they'd stop anyone. Let's pick up a little bit of speed, but in one point in one mile we've got to drop to fifteen just before we get to Bark Green. I do apologise as well if you're experiencing a little bit of frame of like frame rate lag because I'm obviously streaming this from my Xbox onto my Mac so I can record the video. So um, it might there might be some lag triggers every now and then. Can't, can't be helped because I haven't got a capture card. I'm gonna get one at some point, but they're just so expensive. So I'm just relying on inbuilt technology and stuff to get my videos done for my channel. I had the first one in my last video. I think it's because I'm talking. It's very Christmassy. I wish we got snow down where I live, but because I live by the sea, we don't get it. Because I apologise for that. That was my phone. I've got it. Um, yeah, because I live by the sea, obviously the salt in the air, we rarely get snow down this way. How did you drop me to 15 on an incline? slow this I don't like playing this about audio. There we go. 
go. Only about 25 seconds late. Nice to see everyone with their brollies out. Hurry up, we're closing the doors. Hurry up. Too late. <laughs> have to stand in the snow. I ain't waiting round. Right, our next stop is Longbridge Platform 1. Hopefully be there at 918. Not with my driving. Oh, we can't increase to 30 miles an hour for another two and a half miles. Oh god. Why did I pick this scenario again? <laughs> god. Right, I'm going to put my controller down for a minute. Have a stretch. Oh god. Why did we pick this? Oh, hang on, we can speed up. Okay, that didn't tell me that. Oh, okay, never mind. Ignore me. I ain't got a dicky bird what I'm talking about. Is this the um, incline they were talking about in the video? I forgot the name, the name of it now. Is it ink, inkly? Ink, oh, something incline. I forgot the name of it. Well, it's the steepest incline on, on the anywhere on the British Railway now. We ain't gonna get <laughs> please, please don't let me run another red light. Not today. Not today. Oh, okay. Not today. God, we are sliding on the ice. I think the tracks are a bit icy. Right. Remember to stop this time. All that panic for nothing.
Now approaching Longbridge Blackbird at Longbridge Station. Platform one. We were early. Is the doors? Because it takes about 10 seconds for the doors to close. as well at one of the stations to get a torch. Station, Northfield. How's everyone finding Birmingham City, uh, Cross City, DRC anyway? Um, hope you're all enjoying it. I am enjoying it. Um, I've only noticed a few bugs. I'll go into those bugs in a second when I get to this station and stop. So I don't distract myself and miss the platform. So I, I could talk to you about a few bugs I've noticed. Let's get this door back open. Right, um, this weekend I've been trying to do the collectible run. Um, you have to find the maps, the maps, uh, the the route maps are on the wall. You have to find boxes of dairy milk, um, some teddy bears to put Clive's clothing on them, and ball planters like they're shaped like balls because of the ball ringing um, right glitch number one um, even if you find all 25 planters it will only tell you you found 24 out of 25 because one of the planters keeps emptying itself so it doesn't count that you've done it um, glitch number two the park the route maps are very very small when we get um, when we get to a different station, I'll show you. Oh, actually, no, we might have enough time to show you. We'll find the one that's here. Um, unless I've found. Yeah, there's um, 
route maps that you've got to find and they are incredibly incredibly small to the point where you can't even read them so you can't actually see what's on these route maps i've not i've not done stuff at this stage there's a point there that i've not done but um yeah the, the maps are incredibly small to the point you can't read them um the boxes of chocolate you can't get them all because a lot of them are stuck, stuck behind invisible walls and not just that the um the teddies and the chocolate boxes are anywhere on the route so you've got to walk the entire 20 odd mile route to find all this stuff i ain't got time for that so i've not bothered i've done a little bit of the collectibles i just don't think i'm going to bother with the rest um another glitch i've noticed as well is when uh, on certain scenarios and on certain timetables the tail lights on the train don't work uh, if you turn them on, they turn them on to the front along with your headlights, they don't turn them on the back. But this this scenario here, we've got rear lights, which I'll show you in a second when we leave. Like at the moment, you can see on the front, we've got the two, we've got the LED front light and the main beam front light. Um, on some scenarios, you'll get a red one too. The LED one will turn red, which means that's a tail light. But if, once this train gets going, on the rear of this train, this, this one has got tail lights running which means this scenario is working. Um, but on some, it's not. I will report these bugs to Dovetail. But there you go, this one's got tail lights. A lot of the trains, a lot of these scenarios and a lot of the timetables, they're not working. So I will pass that information down. I'll also pass the information down as well about the bugs on the collectibles as well. Too. Um, but apart from that, um, I've not, that's literally just a handful of bugs that I've seen. I'm not going to continue the collectibles run because I just, I I find it quite boring having to just walk the track trying to find all these collectibles. It's just, I may do it at some point if I've got, if I'm bored and I've got nothing else to do. But right now I just, I just, no, I, I, it's just boring just walking the track. Just walking and walking and walking and walking. If I want to have a walk, I'll do that in real life, thanks. <laughs> and anyone that knows me knows I hate walking. <laughs> I ride my bike everywhere, I just hate walking. Okay, our next stop is Kings Norton Platform 1. We're going to be a little bit late. We'll start slowing down a bit because we're about 600 yards out now. Stop, stop, stop. I think we might overrun the track. I don't want to. I wanted this one to be perfect. Oh, God! Right, we're gonna have to go backwards. <laughs> God's sake! I hate the snow! <laughs> The train stops. Let's right. so see what we're doing. Oh, didn't want this to happen. It happened in the last video as well. God damn it. So annoyed at myself. <laughs> I'm normally really good at this game. It only seems to be when I do a video. <laughs> it all goes wrong. <laughs> Why? <laughs> God damn. <laughs> and yes, I'm taking the, 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 the Lord's name in vain. He hates gay people, apparently. Stop. Stop, stop, stop. Go. Put this back into forward. Got to have a signal. 
see the signals indicate. But it shows green, but it's red. Is it because I missed it and I had to go backwards and now it's red? Because it's going to fail me, like the last one. I can't go, it's red. Let me pass. <laughs> Damn it. Right, on. Contact signal. Send in. Send. Oh, God's sake. What, what, what am I supposed to do then? Because if I pass that, it's going to fail me. Oh, it's not. Oh, thank God. Which means we are going to be a little bit late now. But that is my fault. I'll hold my hands up. That's my fault. Right, our next stop is Bourneville, Platform 1, the home of Cadbury's Chocolate. As I said in my last video. Itchy nose. Bit of, bit of frame rate lag, I do apologise for that, it can't be helped. Start breaking so we don't overshoot this platform. Maybe I should play this game. But in my own time, no problems. I do a video, problems. I think it's because I'm talking at the same time. I can't multitask. I am the worst person in the world for multitasking. Well, I can multitask normally with housework and stuff, but if I can't talk and do things at the same time, it doesn't work for me. Breaking. Start breaking. Please start breaking. Oh, come on. I did this perfect. <sighs> well, it's only a little bit. I ain't reversing again. Stuff it. You can all walk the track. Welcome to the home of Cabbage Chocolate. By the canal. There's the Cabris factory. It normally looks better than that, but the weather's poop. train is not taking power correctly, perform a hard reset on the train to see if you can get it moving again. What? Right. Move the handle to power 3. Set it to neutral. Seconds. Oh, oh so Wait ten seconds for the residual power power to drop off. See, this is the problem. I can't hear anything <laughs> because of my audio setup. Right, press the aux on button. Press the pan up button. Set the reverser to forward. Apply some power. Are we moving? Are we moving? Are we moving? 
We is moving. Right, next stop is Selly Oak. Platform one. Right, let's see if we make, uh, not whiz past the station this time, shall we? I hate the snow. Apologise if you can hear that noise. My neighbour upstairs is not the quietest person in the world. Not my best friend neighbour, my other neighbour. He's so loud. Doors. My next stop is University, platform one. some snow. I'm not going to go too fast because uh, the next station is only a short distance away. Stop. Be nice. Stop. Okay. okay. Right, university. Not much to look at. Well, obviously there's the university to look at. But not much else.
doors closed. Our next stop is Five Ways Platform number one. Yeah, I, I don't know if I, I think I said at the beginning of the video, I'm going to do some liveries tonight. A couple of like classic liveries. I might make them at the end. Because I do not like West Midlands Railway, if you're watching this video, I really don't like your livery. Please change it. <laughs> it's horrid. I reckon they should go back to the London Midland City livery because I quite like that livery. But this orange and grey one. I feel the same way about that as I feel about Hershey's chocolate. Not a fan. professional am I? Anybody would think I hadn't slept the last 10 hours. been all right so far apart from my little um platform overshoot earlier but apart from that it's been all right touch wood oh someone's moonwalking on the platform oh god no i'm gonna do it again in i Paying attention to my own thoughts. At least it's not as bad as the last one. I wish it would stop though. Stop. A little bit of an overshoot. And I don't know if this is our last stop. I don't know if we carry on after this or not. With my track record, with my track record at the moment, with platform stopping, maybe that's a good idea that we stop there. Because I'm not doing very well. <laughs> Obviously, because we're coming to Birmingham New Street and you can only travel at 10 miles an hour. For me, that's a good idea.
what you want and they're like, hey, you're... my neck's gone, my back's gone, my hip's gone. this entire time I've got my cab light on. <laughs> well, I had it on. On the room anyway. Down to ten. Doors. Oh, I have a stretch. Oh. oh, what happened there? It's the friggin' NPCs, they knock your camera out. There you go guys that was our our run on red red wine a little bit event uh, eventful with my um very poor station breaking skills <laughs> I, do apologize for that. I hope you enjoyed the video i will be having some more train sim world videos coming out soon um i might have some um train sim world videos of other other routes coming out soon because i've not done very many train sim world videos on my channel um i think it's because i had i've always had train sim world 2 and I've now got Train Simul 3 because of the um, Birmingham Cross City pack, which means all my T uh, Train Simul 2 DLC has now come over. So I might start doing some Train Simul 3 videos again. Uh, I might do some um, London Commuter and some South Eastern High Speed. I have I've had a quick look at the new South Eastern High Speed extension. Um, I might end up. I don't think I'm going to do a 395 video because that would I think that's going to be quite a boring video because it just literally you go from London St Pancras, you stop at Ebbsfleet, and then you just drive to Ashford. It's literally you don't. It's just just watching the track go. I, I don't think that's going to be a very interesting video. I think the more interest more interesting videos are ones like this where it's like stop starts, you know, like uh, station uh, hopping. Um, so I think I might do a four uh, four six five video. Uh, like from Dartford to somewhere, I might do one of those, and I'll be doing some London commuter from Victoria to Brighton, uh, the Gatwick, the Gatwick Express routes and stuff. Yeah, so I'll be doing something like that, and I'm, I might also have a look at some of the um, HST Class Forty Three um, layers for this Birmingham pack and see what they like as well. So if you do enjoy Train Sim World content, uh, feel free to subscribe and like on my channel. It does help my channel to grow and. Also algorithm um if you've got any ideas of any kind of videos you want to see on this channel uh, bear in mind i'm normally just a simulation gamer and i'm limited to 
um, Xbox games and what games my Mac is able to play. So just drop me a comment below. I, I do reply to all of my comments. Um, it may be a few days apart or sometimes immediately, but I do reply to all of them. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching the video. Stay well, stay safe. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Um, and I'll see all of you in my next one. Take care. Goodbye.